when an immense star explodes as a supernova, its guts literally spill across space. But many astrophysicists have long wondered why the remains sometimes take on twisted, asymmetrical shapes. They also leave behind neutron stars, and sometimes black holes, both of which can spin very rapidly. To gain a better understanding, Caltech scientists have run detailed modeling experiments as part of the Simulating Extreme Space Times, or XSX, project. Now that researchers are able to visualize in 3D, several previously puzzling phenomena can be explained by interactions of extremely strong magnetic fields within the star as its core collapses. We are watching the evolution of complex shock waves, which develop as a strongly magnetized, fast-spinning star collapses on its way to forming a neutron star or black hole. The magnetic field lines cross as they twist, winding up in a phenomenon called kink instability, where forces inside grow larger than those outside. Blue and red show us material whose movement is mostly caused by gas interactions. But the parts shown in yellow are those which are responding more to the magnetic forces. Spiraling magnetic fields cause them to twist and torque. In this simulation, you can see how a developing jet must bargain with an unstable spiraling magnetohydrodynamic pulse warping it severely. Here, color represents temperature. Blue is relatively cool, green, warmer, yellow, hot, and red, hottest. A two-dimensional representation is at the left. A 3D section sliced through the meridian is represented on the right. As the cataclysm continues, tornadoes of supermagnetized plasma lash the expanding shock front as it propagates out into space. We're watching the shock wave progress. Here again, color means temperature. Stars 10 to 100 times more massive than the sun are supernovas waiting to happen. Most will leave behind spinning neutron stars, but some form black holes. And it seems the outcome is not just determined by the mass of the collapsing star. Explosions like this one, with crinkled magnetic fields distorting and shunting the expanding jets, building this wide, asymmetrical two-lobed structure may be more likely to spawn a black hole. If future observations of actual supernova remnants bear out these simulations, this is an important finding indeed. For Space.com, I'm Dave Brody. And if you have a question about this, please tweet me at David Sky Brody. Space.com.